hi guys welcome back to my channel as you can already tell from the title today's makeup look is a black china inspired makeup look guys i've been waiting for a while to get this makeup pull up for you guys like last trip so on there i was tempted to do this look but i just wanted something natural so i didn't do it this is actually still natural to me it's just the eyes is just a bit bright it's so summery i really really love it i enjoy creating it and i hope you guys enjoy watching it and don't forget to give it this video a thumbs up if you like it <laughs> give it a thumbs up if you like it don't forget to comment in the comment box below if you have any question to ask about this makeup look or if you guys have any particular makeup look you want me to create and don't also forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not yet subscribed hit the subscribe button right, right now that we're talking okay hit the subscribe button okay don't also forget to turn on your notification um, bell as well so if you're doing that you're going to be getting notification right away as soon as my video is up and yeah without any further ado we're going to jump into this beautiful bright makeup look and i'll see you guys in my next tutorial bye guys so the first thing i did was to apply my barium lip plumping gloss just to keep my lips moisturized for later and then I also went on to do my eyebrows so as usual if you guys want to see how I always achieve this eyebrow make sure you check the description bar below where I'm gonna be leaving a link for my eyebrows tutorial so now I'm gonna quickly start by setting my concealer the one I used to tidy up my eyebrows and I'll be using my NYX powder foundation which is in the shade MFN 90W. So to achieve the black china eye makeup today, I'm gonna to be using three palettes. Yes, it's that deep. I had to use one shade from each palette to actually achieve what I wanted. Who's judging? I'm not judging. Are you? Are you judging me? No? no? Okay. So I'm gonna first start by using the Clara's Cosmetic Palette. Yeah, I'm gonna be picking up this orange right here. Now that that is done, I'm gonna be going into my Morphe Palette. This is the Morphe 350, if you guys are wondering. And I'm gonna be picking up this kind of darkish orange shade as well I'm placing it just a bit above my crease before we move on to the BH cosmetic palette I'm going to be going into my uh, BH cosmetic eye and lip primer just to prime my eyelid and make the red shade I'm going to use come out a bit brighter Now that that is done, I'm going to be going into my BH Cosmetic Palette. This is the 28 Color Palette Smoky Eye Edition. And I'm going to be grabbing this bright red right here. And I'll be placing it all over my lid. I'm just going to quickly blend out the red just a bit, not that much, so there will be no ash lines. Now I'm going to quickly line my eye with my Romeo London Lip Eyeliner. I'm not going to be winging out my eyeliner today, I just want to keep it natural, so I'm just going to line just my eyelid. mascara today I'm going to be using my Max Factor mascara and this is in the shade black today I'm going to be using my red cherry wispy lashes and with that I'll be using my dew glue to help me glue it on so to prime my face today I'm going to be using my W7 face primer this is the camera ready Thank you. 
for foundation today i'm going to be using my stila stay all day foundation and concealer this is in the shade warm number 13. because this foundation is a very very thick foundation i always like to damp my beauty sponge in water and squeeze out any excess in it just to make it a lot more easier for me to blend them out So to conceal my under eye today, I'll be using my LA Girl Pro Concealer. This is in the shade Pure Beige. To cream contour today, I'm also going to be using my Stila Corrector Stick. This is in the shade Tan. So to set my concealer today, I'm going to be using my W7 Banana Dream Loose Powder. Because I want a full and plump lip, I'm going to be using my lip plumper. This one is a silicone um, lip plumper as you can see. I'm going to suck on this while I set my creamy contour, so here we go. Today I'm still going to be using my NYX um, Color Wheel Bronzer. Now I'm just going to quickly dust out my excess powder. Now I'm going to be lining my waterline with my Primark White Eyeliner. I'm going to be using the brush I used to pick up my red colour just to smoke out my under eye. Still going back to my Clara's Cosmetics palette, I'm going to be picking out this um, orange shade again just to help me blend out my under eyes more. I'm going to quickly spray my face with my NYX finish spray and this is the dual finish. To highlight my face today, I'm still going to go back to my Clara's Cosmetic Palette. I want to do something bold and stupid today guys. I'm going to be picking up this white shade eyeshadow just to highlight my face today. Now I'm going to be going back to my Max Factor Mascara, this time around I'm going to be applying it to my bottom lashes. So basically for the lips today we're not going to be using lip liner because from the picture it clearly shows Black China didn't use lip liner, okay? So what I'm going to be doing now, I'm going to be grabbing a matte lipstick that's closer to my skin shade that looks really really good on me and is the Seat Matte Liquid Lipstick. This is in the shade 166. I tried to, you know, keep this lips like this. I can't, I can't, I can't. Like, no, this is not me. I kick her lip liner. This is in the shade 531. I'm not gonna line it as much, just a bit. 